Could you share a bit about your professional journey and how it has led you to specialize in HR and workplace mediation? So when I tell my friends that my favorite part of my work is dealing with conflict, I oftentimes get slightly, why? As an answer, I have spent my whole career working in human resources. And through that work, I realize that in addressing the difficult situations, you enable the joy, the happiness, the fun to take place for everybody else. You have a responsibility both to the individuals who are having problems and difficulties, but to all of the rest of your team. And if you don't deal with the problems, then the impact on the rest of the team is enormous. If you deal with the problems, then you create a happier work environment. What specific experiences or challenges have shaped your expertise in managing difficult workplace situations? So through the work that I've done, I have dealt with a large array of different types of conflicts, from minor interpersonal disputes to very serious conflicts involving multiple different parties within organizations, all the way through to the Workplace Relations Commission and dealing with issues that have landed on their desk. The issue or the thing that I keep coming back to is early intervention conflict resolution. The sooner that you get in there, the sooner that you attempt to resolve a conflict, the easier it will be to resolve. It's very important for line managers to know where they have the skills, where they can resolve a conflict directly, but also it is a skill to know this is beyond my remit. Where do I go for help? What does that look like? So some of what we're talking about through the course is doing what you can do and knowing when to hand it over. Have you encountered any particularly challenging situations in your career and how did you navigate them? I've encountered many challenging situations. I have encountered challenging employees, probably the likes of which that you haven't necessarily come across and don't have in your organization. My approach in handling them is it's quite simple. Follow your policies, procedures, adhere to the law, treat people with dignity and respect at all times, but you have to keep moving forward. You have to keep dealing with it and addressing the issues. Just because you have a very challenging individual or a very challenging situation, you cannot avoid it. So it's developing the skills. It's a bit like a muscle that you exercise, developing that skill set and, and growing in strength in that area. Secure your spot now for next week's course before it's gone. We only have a few spots available.